Hello students, welcome to iSmart Technology. This video is about find out roots of a quadratic equations. Public class quadratic here class is a keyword, quadratic is a program name, public static void main string ARGS, main is a function which is executing a program double a equal to 2, b equal to 11, c equal to 5. A, B, C are variable which are basically used to store a value in the variable. Here we have taken data type as a double. So we can store any real number value also. Double root 1 comma root 2. Root 1 and root 2 are quadratic roots of a quadratic equation. Now double D equal to B square minus 4AC. If you want to write down b square, so you have to write down b multiplied by b minus 4ac, you have to write down 4 multiplied by a multiplied by c. So you can say that d equal to b square minus 4ac. d you can say that delta or determinant. System dot out print ln value of determinant is d. Suppose we have taken a equal to 2, b equal to 11 and c equal to 5. So b square minus 4ac is 121 minus 40. So determinate value of d is 81. Now we have three possibility of d. First d is positive if d is greater than, the, greater than 0. Second is d equal to 0 and third is d less than 0. First of all we have to understand d greater than 0 means determinant is positive. It gives two value root 1 and root 2. The formula is minus b minus b plus root delta divided by 2a. Here we have written root 1 equal to minus b plus math dot sqrt d for determinant. So, math dot sqrt, what is the value of d we have calculated? It is 81. So, square root of 81 is 9. Minus b means minus 11 plus 9. It will be minus 2 divided by 2a means divided by 4. It will give minus 0. Point, minus 0. Point 5. Now root 2 minus b minus again 9 divided by 2a minus b is minus minus 11 minus 9 divided by 2a. It will be minus 20 divided by 4. It gives the minus 5. So system dot out format root 1 equal to 0.2f and root 2 equal to 0.2f. Root 1 value store in first root 2f. Root 1 value will store in the first 0.2f and root 2 value will store in second 0.2f. Here system dot out format. Format is basically used for display the value in the decimal form. 0.2f means it will display the value after it will display the two digit after the decimal point. Now another scenario is this else if d equal to 0 suppose determinant equal to 0. First of all we have discussed d is positive then we have to discuss d equal to 0. If d equal to 0 there are root 1 and root 2 equal to minus b divided by 2a minus b divided by 2a. Here minus b minus 11 divided by 4 2 multiply 2a means 2 multiplied by 2 so minus 11 divided by 4 will be the answer now system dot out format root 1 equal to root 2 equal to point 0.2f if d is not positive d is not 0 then what will be the scenario d is negative if the roots are not real then we have two part real part and imaginary part 
if you want to calculating a real part minus b divided by 2a and if you want to calculating a imaginary part math dot sqrt minus d divided by 2a and after calculating this thing you have to display the result of system dot out print system dot out format root 1 equal to 0.2 0.2f plus 0.2f i first is real part and second is imaginary part and root 2 is 0.2f minus minus 0.2f so first value display in first portion first value display in first portion and root 2 will be dis root 2 answer or will be calculated in root 2 portion now here our program is completed let's we have to check in our case a equal to 2 b equal to 11 c equal to 5 so our our determinant will be 9 so 9 is positive so first condition will be executed here you can see value of determinant is 81 and root 1 equal to minus 0 0.5 and root 2 equal to minus 5 that we have already discussed thank you very much